know, governments are always going to encroach. And, and we sometimes we think that, um, well, we will allow them to do that so that no one else will encroach. Right. And, and uh, they'll bring war, but then they will bring peace. But the thing is, like, uh, they were always going to do that anyway. So we're saying, like, we will allow them to encroach so no one else will encroach. But there, it was for them to do it. And here's the funny thing. Here's the thing that's, it's not funny, but it's kind of weird. Like, um, uh, you know, Turkey encroaching in Syria. And then when Turkey gets attacked by a Syrian jet or something, they're like, uh, oh, it was low. It was, do it was dirty. It was a betrayal. They say it's betray betrayal. You, you know what I mean? But, um... But it was for them to encroach because that's their militarized government, you know. And the people that uh, that um, repeat this stuff, like the, this mil this militarized government, is you're never going to come in contact with them. So I don't. It doesn't make sense for 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 you to uh, repeat their eugenics. Um, agendas and 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 say certain things that can be astonishingly uh, appalling you know like uh and to suggest because the, they brought back all those energetic levels for us to toggle with like you know like who's a racist and like who's really doing their religion and everything because all that shit is just designed so that nothing will never do anything it's perfectly designed for inaction, for inaction. When action, when less action is actually better. So, you know what I mean? So it's like counterintuitive. But yeah.